to be. The merchant who bought it from the Sultan of Galopolis must have sold it to the tournament organizers. Does this mean we're going to have to enter the tournament? <laughs> nope. It means we're going to have to win it. down and dirty. It's time to find out who'll be paired with who. Let's hope everyone gets the partner they deserve. I'm going to draw balls from this box right here and call out the numbers. Each pair of numbers forms a team. Fighters will be counting on you to make the most of whoever you're matched with. Remember, teamwork makes the dream work. Alrighty, let's get started. First number is 11! Fighter number 11, step right up! <sighs> All right, now time to find out who'll be fighting beside you. Let's see. Who will it be? Eight! It's fighter number eight! Number eight, make your way up to the stage. Charmed, I'm sure. Hold on a wee second there. Huh? I'm not putting this young lassie's fate in the hands of a ballyhoo like you and your box of balls. Sir, it's... it's the rules. I... I mean... Um, allow me to check that with the uh, official adjudicator. My mistake, fighters. Seems this gentleman here has a... Uh, a special arrangement! Number 11 gets another pick of the partner pot! Oi! What's the big idea? Play fair, will ya? Come on now, folks. 
Be reasonable. The, the official adjudicator has spoken. Now, why don't we see who number 11 will be fighting beside? It's number... Number seven, come on down! Looks like I'm up. <gasps> ah, Vince got picked already. Well, how about that? Number 11's new partner is last year's champion, Octagonia's favorite son, Vince! Hey man, good to meet you. Let's break some heads. That's it, folks. Our teams have been decided. Now all that remains is to wait for the action to begin. Let's wish the best of luck to all our fighters! that you've been paired with last year's champion. Lucky old you. Not that you even need a partner. I was just saying to Veronica, they should change the rules so you can compete on your own. Wasn't I, Veronica? Veronica? Where's she gone? She was here a moment ago. What's all that commotion outside? Oh. Oh, dear. Why don't you learn to look where you're going? Me look where I'm going? You're the one strolling around with your nose in the air, you snooty little midget. What? That's ridiculous. You walked right into me, you big lump. Didn't your mother ever teach you to say sorry? Cool. You really don't know where to shut up, do ya? This is all I need after me bleeding, stinking luck and that bleeding, stinking drool. Don't take it out on the kid under Digger. We all have our bad days. Who said that? Come here and I'll... <gasps> Ch champ. <gasps> I get it. You didn't get the draw you wanted. But you gotta roll with the punches, man. I mean, you're a tough guy. What does it matter who you partner with, right? Well, since you put it like that, champ... Ah... Uh, sorry, Squirt. <laughs> I'll, uh... Kev? Uh, 
Uh, Kev, is that you, mate? Kev? <laughs> Veronica, are you all right? Hey there, partner. You know this little lady? I guess all's well that ends well, huh? Glad I could help out. All right, gotta bounce. I got kids to feed, then I'm hitting the sack. We ain't gonna win tomorrow if we don't rest up. You take it easy too, you hear? I'll come get you bright and early. Rise and shine, partner. Time to hit the arena. bumping into each other like this. Oh, give me a break, will ya? Up against a champ in the first round. I must have the worst bleeding, stinking luck in the whole bleeding, stinking world. Right, you, here's the plan. We wallop the kid first, then we move on to Vince, right? That way, we might actually stand a chance of getting out of here alive. Sure thing, we're gonna win this easy, and then all the girls are gonna be swooning over me, and <laughs> you'll see. <sighs> all right, teams, I want a nice clean back. On my way. Here it comes, folks. That's it! It's all over! Vince has done it again! Nice job, partner. You're tougher than you look. Hmm. Huh. Sounds like the next fight started already. Would you look at the kid go? She's incredible! <laughs> <laughs> uh -oh. 
This girl, I can barely keep up. <sighs> and what's with the old guy? He's just standing there. You do make it ever so easy. <laughs> You're done, kid. Fight's over! Rab and Jade are the winners! <gasps> Heavens be praised! How are we supposed to compete with that? Admit it, Vince. Even you're impressed. Yeah, she ain't bad. All right, folks. Here are the teams who'll be fighting it out for your pleasure in the final bouts. Will Vince and his new sidekick prove invincible and take the title again? Oh. Will Rab and Jade continue their incredible run and pip the champ at the post? It's all still to play for. Come back tomorrow when the action continues. You won't want to miss it! I lucked out getting you as my partner. We're in with the chance, you and me. Anyway, I better go. The kids will be waiting for me back at the orphanage. Yourself going out in the first round. Look, I did the best I could, okay? But she's... she's not normal. <laughs> Are you sure you weren't just love-struck? You looked a bit weak at the knees to me. And what with her flashing her legs around like that? Well... <gasps> Veronica! It's them! Excuse me, lassie. Would you mind standing aside? Uh, oh, yes, of course. Sorry. Shall we? Hmm. I'd keep a close eye on your partner if I were you. Keep an eye on Vince? What does she mean by that? You don't think it could be anything to do with the missing people we heard about, do you? Didn't someone say that they were all competitors in the tournaments they have here? Could... Could Vince be in danger? Missing people? That's the first I've heard of it. Doesn't sound good, though. Maybe you should go check on Vince. Don't want your partner disappearing before the big day.
Oh, it's you. Man, I thought you were some creep sneaking up on me. Sorry, it's just... I keep hearing about fighters going missing. Kinda puts a guy on edge, you know? Didn't mean to scare you, partner. Seeing as you're here, why don't you come inside? Kids were good while I was gone, right? Uh huh. Is this a friend of yours, Uncle Vince? Yup, a very important one. So you play quietly while he's here, okay? Oh, be sure, be sure. I was born and raised in this orphanage, man. That's actually why I fight. Wanted to raise some money, give a little something back, you know. Trouble is, fighting's all I'm good at. If I stop winning, these kids stop eating. Huh. <laughs> Won't be a problem this year, though. You and me were going all the way. Good to have you along for the ride, partner. Man, look at the time. Sorry, once I start gabbing, I kind of find it hard to stop. Wait, was there something you wanted to talk about? I mean, I'm guessing that's why you came to... Huh. Hey, did you hear that? It came from my room. There it is again. There's somebody up there! Huh. Some punks tossed my room. What kind of lowdown? Dirty thief burglarizes an orphanage anyhow. And what were they looking for? Uh, <clears throat> Just you creeps, wait! Oh, uh, listen. We got a fight to think about. It's late. You should stay here tonight. You down with that? All right. Go get some shut-eye. I'll wake you when it's time to hit the arena. Up and at him, partner. It's fighting time. That's the spirit. We got a fight to get to. Gentlemen, are you ready for some more masked martial arts action? Our first fight of the day features the favorites for the title. It's the Invincibles, starring none other than reigning champion, Vince Vanquish! They'll be facing off against hometown hotties, Cinderella and Wambolina, a.k.a. the BT Queens! <laughs> 
I'm Cinderella. And I'm Wambolina. Hello, boys. The girls have brought their fan club along. Well, get ready to cheer your hearts out, folks. Something tells me this is going to be about to remember. Fighters, get ready to go to war. Don't let the pretty, pretty act fool you. They made it this far. That means they can fight. On your marks. Get set! Fight! Gentlemen, we're into the semi-finals, and here come our first challengers. Give them a big hand now. It's the Invincibles! They'll be taking on a pair of dashing dark horses who surprised us all with their flair for ferocity. It's Golden Boy and Sterling Silva, a.k.a. The Bullion Boys! Huh? Yoo-hoo! Look out below! Huh? Yeah! At last, foul villain! I had hoped you would survive long enough to suffer at my hands! <laughs> now, time to lie back and let the great Sylph... <clears throat> I mean, the magnificent Sterling Silva show you which of us is the better once and for all! Uh, so you guys know each other? Ha! Know each other? None can know the true identity of Sterling Silva and live. Nor that of his faithful sidekick, Golden Boy. The Bullion Boy's real names will go with them to their graves. Huh. These guys sure know how to put on a show. No, these things. We will not be holding back. Our onslaught will be merciless and swift. <laughs> Likewise. Just my little pre-fight ritual. All right, let's do this. Looks like our fighters are ready to rumble, folks. All right, on my word. Fight!
I'm on fire! Not bad. <sighs> That's enough. I'm calling this one. The Bullion Boys have been beaten! <sighs> Curses. The great Silva... Um, uh, Sterling Silva defeated? But I feel no shame in losing to one such as you. It was a battle of epic and legendary proportions, and I thank you for it. Good luck in the final, darling. <laughs> <laughs> there he goes. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the showdown you've all been waiting for. The grand final of the Masked Martial Arts Tournament! That's right, just two teams remain. Invincibles, if you please! They're hot favorites, folks, but will our hometown hero be able to retain his crown? Or will surprise newcomers Rab and Jade snatch glory from the reigning champ? Will the princess and the pudding please take to the stage? Yes, it's the girl who moves like lightning and the old guy who doesn't move at all! Will they be making history here today? It's time to find out. Something about these two gives me the willies. But we got this. Time for a little good luck boost. Let's do this. Let's win this thing. <clears throat> All right, laddie. Show us what you've got. This is it, folks. One last time now. <laughs> Fight! You're napping, old man! Huh? Ah! Oh. 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 
You too? What's with everybody all of a sudden? Not that I'm complaining. You're up, partner! We, we have a winner! Vince Vanquish has done it again! Take the final! And what a final it was! Stick around for the award ceremony, folks! We did it, man! We won! It wasn't easy, though, huh? That was the toughest tournament yet. Thanks for seeing it through with me, partner. Hey, the grand prize is something called the Rainbow. Word is, it's worth a bunch of dough. How about we sell it and split the... It's me, Rab. I need a wee word with you. Can I come in? Just you in here, eh, laddie? I was hoping to speak to your pals, too. Could you ask them to join us? It's Jade. The last I was fighting with in the tournament. She's missing. I've looked all over town, but she's nowhere to be found. I can't help but worry she's got herself caught up in something. Will you help an old man look for his wee friend? You're a star. With yourself and your pals here to help, I'm sure we'll find her in no time. Right. The last place anyone saw her was over by the orphanage. Let's start there, shall we?
Battle!
Brought you a fresh one! must have missed one when he cleared the monsters out of town all those years ago. <laughs> huh? Nicely done, lassie. I hope you'll forgive me, but we had a wee rummage around in your room, Vince. The liquid I found. Now that's what you drink before the fights, isn't it? Or your friend who you squeezes from the fighters you kidnap. That... That was you? <laughs> Perhaps not all humans are as stupid as our muscle-bound friend here. That's right, old man. Hendrix scarred me, but he did not kill me. The extract. It was the only way to regain my Strength. So I had Vince bring me the choicest morsels. And why would he help me do such a thing, you ask? Because I offered to share the fruits of my labor. To give him strength beyond imagining. Who could refuse? Such a juicy offer, hmm? <laughs> I couldn't keep on winning forever. And if I wasn't winning, I wasn't bringing in the money we needed for the orphanage. Sorry, partner, but I can't let those kids down. Which means I can't let you and your friends leave. Not now! <sighs> oh, will you look at yourself, laddie? Do you not see what that stuff's doing to you? That foul fluid wasn't meant for human consumption. It's eating you from the inside out. It's a miracle you're still alive. Uh, uh, man. Uh, I guess cheaters never prosper, huh? <laughs> Spent at last, old friend. Such a shame. Then I suppose I'll have to deal with you myself. <sighs> Keep that thing busy. I'll see if I can get those people down.
Ah, not bad at all. I just keep getting better. And don't come back. I... I had no choice. A third-rate fighter like me? I was never gonna make enough dough to keep the place open. So when I heard that voice... drifting up from down here... right beneath the orphanage... I... I listened. All I had to do was help him out, and he'd make me the toughest fighter around. Seemed like a pretty sweet deal. So I said sure. I wanted to win the tournament so bad, needed that money so bad, I let him use me. I knew it was wrong. But that orphanage, man, that's where I was raised. Those kids are my family. I had to do it. I had to. <laughs> so you let your desire to help the Bairns get the better of you. Well, there's certainly been greater evils done for less good. Tell you what, I'll have a word or two with the mayor. Don't worry, lad. We'll make sure the orphanage is looked after. So, chin up, eh? Just don't let me catch you making deals with nasty beasts again. You hear? Sir, I... I don't know what to say. Wakey, wakey, little soldier. Come on now, time to get up. I said, wake up! Morning, darling! Hate to drag you out of bed, but we need to head up to the arena. That prize they never got around to giving you? Well, they want to hand it over. Let's get moving, before they change their mind. If you're looking for me, I'll be in the cheap seats. Don't forget to give me a wave. Everybody, it's time to bring this year's Masked Martial Arts Tournament to a close. It's prize-giving time. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you our champions, the Invincibles! And now, to present the prize... Hold on! Hold on!
seems kind of a shame to have the good folks of Octagonia come out and support us and not give them a show to enjoy. Why don't we make this interesting? I challenge you to a fight for the prize, partner. Winner takes all! Ladies and gentlemen, the gauntlet has been thrown down! Now that's the stuff champions are made of! No backing out now, unless you want to ride on your hands. <laughs> I don't do that stuff anymore. I fight clean or not at all. Now let's do this! <laughs> Vince looked kind of weak out there. He sure did. What's gotten into him? Uh, I needed people to see that. To see that I ain't nothing without that juice. I never had what it takes to be the champ. You deserve that prize, man. Thanks. You taught me what it means to be a fighter again. I won't forget this time. We love you, Vince! Thanks for putting it on the line for us every time! You're a true champ, man! It gives me great pleasure to announce that the winner of the rainbow is... This is bad. This is real bad. Huh? It's the rainbow. It's gone. And all there was instead was this. And this letter too. Looks like it's for you. Come and meet me in Dundrasil. I've something to show you. Don't worry about the rainbow. It's safe with me. What a shocking twist to end our tale, ladies and gentlemen. The grand prize snatched from under our champion's nose by none other than Old Man Rab! Will our hero journey to Dundrasil to claim what's rightfully his? How will it all end? I, for one, can't wait to find out! Dundrasil, huh? So it's back to where it all began. Hmm. <sighs>